James Bradow from Aussie Land and Livestock reporting for the uh, ninth um, Coolabunya Classic Charolais Bull Sale held at Coolabunya today. I'm here with uh, Graham Blanche from Charnel Charolais. Graham is the president of the Queensland Charolais Society, Queensland region. We're just going to be a bit of a wrap up today. Um, we had 100% clearance, which is a fantastic result. Um, great lineup of bulls. Uh, the average was $11,170. Uh, the top price is this magnificent bull here that uh, bred by Graham. There's only um, a couple of these Johnny bulls in Australia at present, and I'm certain there'll be more coming. Uh, he topped at 26000 He went up to the Betterfield Charolais well, start up at Villa Wheeler. Um, also of note was the uh, volume buyer was May Lake Proprietary Limited from uh, down the Brisbane Valley. And uh, those bulls will be going across um, a drought master herd. Uh, they've mainly bought red factor bulls and uh, we can't wait to see the calves out of them. I think we're going to see some great calves. Now, welcome in now, we've got 13,000 online gone. 13,000 online gone. Who do 13,000 online gone? Who do you mean? 13,000 to be now, to be 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, 14, was every bit as good as we've ever offered. Very consistent and getting a 100% clearance probably reflected on that. Um, the quality of bulls, the diversity of genetics that are in this sale, uh, a number of Homer's Gigas bulls, but yeah, a large number of pole bulls. Um, yes, we did exceptionally well. I'm not sure what our average, but uh, this fellow here is our very first Johnny bull. Johnny is a powerful French bull that we've imported semen from a couple of years ago um, and we had his first couple of sons in Australia that were born in Australia that actually were here today and uh, this was the first one and he is off to Betterfield Charolais. Now uh, the Kayaski family uh, have been supporting, big supporters of our genetics for a large number of years, uh, way back in 2004 I think it was. Uh, they bought a couple of stud bulls from us and they bought a number ever since and alongside that they've also bought a number of females from us. So great supporters, um, we especially appreciate our return buyers uh, because they're the ones in really tough years that um, you know keeps you going. Keep and volume buyer. Yeah, 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 yeah. We had a, a fairly good percentage of studs attempting to buy genetics today. It, it is a reflection, I would say, on uh, the genetics that are being offered through the Coolabunya sale. The fact that so many studs are trying to source their sires um, through this sale. Yes, that's right, James, and that's very pleasing. Um, with, at Charnel, yes, uh, a little bit different from the other uh, three vendors here, more so, although uh, River Run has used AI. The, um, Diamond L bulls were all by AI size this time as well. Uh, but yeah, we have sourced genetics from overseas in, in recent years. 2016, we uh, introduced a couple of bulls from Canada, uh, Blackjack and uh, CML Distinction. And a number of the Blackjack sons sold really well today. Yeah, Graham, we're um, looking at lot 27 here. We're just saying before that there's um, a lot of faith in the industry for a, um, a bull like this, um, such such high yeah, quality don't. bull, uh, going to into a commercial herd like he'll be um, used as a terminal sire. Um, the buyers were saying before uh, that he's going to complement their cows perfectly. Yes, that's right, James. I mean, uh, the confidence in people uh, to pay 25000 for a really great commercial bull. We've collected semen out of this bull uh, to use in our own herd, so we, we put him up in the bracket of a stud sire. Uh, but yes, it's just really wonderful to see um, that he will be going into some very, very good drought master cows uh, for the Davis family up at uh, Waluga. You have won, you see them coming through the store sales, the progenies, yeah, um, yep. week after week, and you can see what the quality of bulls is doing to uh, the quality of cattle 
that's uh, coming no, through your store sales. It certainly helps our sales and helps all our vendors with their sales regardless of where they live. And that's something else I would um, noted, the quality of bulls across across all the vendors, the bar just keeps getting raised every year. That's something um, I should be, uh, we're thankful to our vendors for, that they keep investing so much into genetics and uh, just keep coming back and lifting the bar every year. Yeah, well thanks James, and yeah, I, I like to uh, speak on behalf of all the vendors, and we, we really appreciate uh, what Aussie Land and Livestock do up here, the whole team, it's a, it's a wonderful team from go to woe, and including the ladies in the office, and it just backs us 100%, and it just gives us the incentive to bring the right product to a sale like this. Uh, temperament is absolutely important and you will notice today right through the whole catalogue the temperament was very very good and these are bulls that are put in strange places. Yeah, that, they big don't mobs much of, of a people, chance. Big mobs of people, um, you know they're put on trucks and uh, yeah so we're very very proud of, of what we have uh, offered here today and, and we just really really hope that whoever buys them, uh, all the buyers, a lot of return buyers, I don't know what the percentage would be but it would be very high of percentage of uh, return buyers and uh, we hope that they are very happy with their purchases and that they do very very well for them, yeah. um, you know, beyond their expectations. Yeah, um, like uh, I'd, I'd especially like to thank um, the Silverwood Stud, um, River Run Stud, the Diamond L um, Charolais and Charbray Stud and uh, the Charnel Stud. Um, tremendous lineup of bulls. Uh, we couldn't have asked any more in the preparation. Uh, just remembering a lot of these bulls were actually, they were bred in the really tough times when it was dry and everyone was struggling to feed cattle. So um, it's, it's really great to see that they're um, getting the benefits of good prices and um, their continued industry focus is given bulls that deliver results across the board. Yes, thanks, thanks James.